My name is Yvette Rodriguez Marquez. I am the principal at Cesar Chavez Leadership Academy. So I started working at Cesar Chavez Leadership Academy four years ago. Um, it had just come off of a state takeover. So for many years, um, the school had been persistently underperforming. Our community faces um, income challenges. About 99% of our students receive free or reduced lunch here. 60% of our students come to us as English language learners. So when we began our work as a team, when I arrived here at Chavez, we did a lot of introspection, a lot of surveys to students and parents and teachers around what they felt were the, the things that were really gonna push our school to make it a great place to be. And one of the things that did come up was, was culture. Um, teachers and parents felt like um, we needed to do something about creating a, cu a culture that was positive and focused on student achievement. As a community, we decided to move forward with the adoption of a leadership program um, based on Stephen Covey's Seven Habits of Highly Effective People called The Leader in Me. Our teachers wanted to make sure that our students have all of the skills they need to be successful and in that way avoid negative behaviors. Everywhere that students look, they should feel that they are surrounded by positivity, uh, by examples of leadership, by examples of people using the seven habits. This should be a place that they wanna be. And I think that when you walk into the building, the building exudes that now. And I think that's important for a school. We started participating with the Real TNG grant about three years ago. The Real TNG grant has provided um, a really great framework to define success in our school, both instructionally and in terms of academic results and student achievement. I feel like throughout the implementation of our grant, our student achievement has increased quite a bit. Today, we are sitting at an extremely high B. To score an A, according to the Department of Education, we needed 140 points. We had 137, which is incredible for a school uh, that was facing so many struggles such a short time ago. 